There are rich teams and there are poor teams. Then there's 50 feet of crap. And then there's us. That's a dollar, man. What? Welcome to Oakland. Hi, everybody. I'm here with Jonah Hill, who co-stars with Brad Pitt in the new movie about baseball and a whole lot more. It's called Moneyball. And I want to, first of all, congratulate you on this film. It's great. I loved it. Thank you so much. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I cannot be more proud. Now, let me ask you, this film certainly on the surface is about baseball, but there's really a much deeper and more personal story to this film, isn't it? Yeah, I think, you know, obviously, I think the filmmakers used baseball as a, as a beautiful aesthetic backdrop to a really moving story about underdogs and being undervalued. And I think that's really what the movie's about, and I think uh, it's really moving. I need more money. We're not New York. Find players with the money that we do have. I like Perez. Got an ugly girlfriend. Ugly girlfriend means no confidence. You guys are talking the same old nonsense, like we're looking for Fabio. We got to think differently. Who's Fabio? Your goal shouldn't be to buy players. Your goal should be to buy wins. And in order to buy wins, you need to buy runs. Who are you? I'm Peter Brand. First job in baseball? It's my first job anywhere. Now, I understand that you had to sort of fight for this role because you, there might have been some other people that would have seen you in a different light right. in terms of this particular role. Yeah, I mean, I'm an underdog. I'll always be an <laughs> underdog, you know. I, I feel very similar to how I felt when Superbad came out because uh, I was an underdog, you know. I, I was not famous or anything, and I was the star of this movie, and uh, I was saying, hey, I'm Jonah, I'm in this movie, nice to meet you. Uh, I want to do more of these kind of movies. I hope you accept me. And luckily, they did, and you know, and now it's not unexpected for me to be in a comedy. But now I feel the same way because I'm saying, hey, I'm Jonah, I'm in this movie Moneyball, that is very different than anything you've ever seen me do. It's a drama, and I'd like to do some more of these movies, and I hope you accept it. We're gonna shake things up. Why don't you walk me through the board? I believe there's a championship team that we can afford, because everyone else undervalues them, like an island of misfit toys. So following up on that, you started off last year with Cyrus trying to sort of change that image of you from the Judd Apatow, very well done uh, films uh, right. that were more in the comedic range. Now you're doing something more dramatic. How important to you as an actor was it to make that transition? Well, you know, I'm really proud of all the comedies that I've done and I'm really proud of Cyrus and now with Moneyball, the dramas, the dramas I've done, two of them, <laughs> all two of them. And uh, I just think it's really important to challenge yourself and to do things that are different. And I'm as much of a dramatic actor as I am a comedic actor. I've just done a lot of comedies and haven't had the opportunity as much. And, you know, hopefully this uh, movie Moneyball opens the door for me to do both dramas and comedies. We want you at first base. I've only ever played catcher. It's not that hard, Scott. Tell him, watch. It's incredibly hard. He can't throw. But what can he do? Do you want me to speak? When I point at you, yeah. He gets on base. Have there been times where you look at this film and you think, wow, I can't believe I'm acting with all these great performers. You've got and Philip Seymour Hoffman, and of course, you've got a great chemistry with Brad Pitt. What was that like for you, and what did you learn from that? I mean, it was really intimidating to work with all of these people. I mean, Aaron Sorkin, who wrote The Social Network, and Steve Zalian, who wrote Schindler's List, wrote this movie, and Bennett Miller, who directed Capote, directed it, and obviously Brad, and Philip Seymour Hoffman, and Robin Wright. So. It was incredibly intimidating, uh, but I felt like I had to, not to use a terrible pun, but play at the top of my game because, you know, they trusted me with this, to be the second lead in this film, and I did not want to let them down. Mm -hmm. But working with all of them was great, and I had a tremendous amount to learn from all of them, and, and getting to play, you know, the central relationship of the movie is really Brad and my character, and it's really, really really great. It was a really great experience to, to get to work with him. We are card count at the blackjack table. We're going to turn the odds on the casino. I'm heading in. Text me to play by play. Wait, what? I don't watch the games. What was the relationship like with you and Brad Offset? I heard you guys had a lot of fun playing pranks on one another and maybe some of the other's crew. Yeah, we definitely got into it. He's a prank master. He's the Bobby Fischer of prank chess. He's playing chess mental games all the time with these pranks and he's he's brilliant at it billy bean has tried to reinvent a system that's been working for years it was
was a nice theory, just not working out. How long is Philly Bean going to last? He's proven himself right out of a job. In their minds, it's threatening the game. It's threatening the way that they do things. Hey, Daddy, do you think you'll lose your job? What? Wait, you hear that? I like go on the internet sometimes. Don't go on the internet. Watch TV or talk to people. Have you ever felt like an underdog in other aspects of your life? Sure, I think, you know, I just relate to the underdog mentality. I think I think I always tend to root for the underdogs and, and you know, I just, I just, yeah, of course, of course. Well, this film is definitely not an underdog. I want to thank you. It's a pleasure. You did a great job in this film. Thank you very much. We've been talking with Jonah Hill, who stars with Brad Pitt in the new film Moneyball. Be sure you go out and catch it in theaters now. I'm Tim Estilos for Boston Latino TV. You're discounting what scouts have done for 150 years? What the hell am I doing? What is happening at Oakland? It defies everything we know about baseball. Just plain crazy! This team will change the game. This better work. I'm just kidding.